In this video, we're going to be looking at this curve C, which has the equation 4x squared plus y squared equals 64. Find the image of C after part A, a translation by the vector minus 2, 5, and separately, uh, part B, a stretch parallel to the x-axis by factor 8. Write your answers in the form ax squared plus bx plus cy squared plus dy equals e, where a, b, c, d, and e are integers. OK, so for part A then, if we're going to be translated by the vector minus 2, 5, we've got to replace the x with x plus 2. And we've got to replace the y with y minus 5. So four lots of x plus 2 squared plus y minus 5 squared is equal to 64. So we just need to expand this out then. So we're going to get 4x squared plus, now that'll be 4x times 4, so 16x. And then we're going to get 4 times 4, so 16. Plus y squared, take away 10y plus 25 is equal to 64. So this would be 4x squared plus 16x plus y squared minus 10y equals, we've got the 64, we're going to take away 25, we're going to take away 16, and so we get 23. Okay, and so this is the equation of my ellipse uh, after this translation. So for part B, if instead we're doing a stretch parallel to the x-axis by factor 8, that means we need to replace the x with 1 8th x. So this would be 4 lots of 1 8th x squared plus y squared equals 64. So 4 lots of 1 8th squared is 4 over 64, which is 1 over 16. So 1 over 16 x squared plus y squared equals 64. But we need the coefficients to be integers here, OK? So I'm going to have to multiply through by 16. So we get x squared plus 16, sorry, y squared. And then 64 times 16 is 1024. And so it is in the form that we want, where the a is 1, the b is 0, c is 16, d is 0, and the e is 1024.